I have a question. And you're not going to like me very much. I watched the discussion last evening. And Fred is saying quite frequently that our big problem is the volume of waste. And you were mentioning that last evening, Chris, of course, your staffing and the inability to perform some things, especially in the high summer. And I have two observations. The first one is that I don't believe we should be collecting commercial waste at all. I have said this before and people get mad at me that I think it's a very bad thing for a community to be doing to have the public and businesses that do pay to dispose of their own waste, like the galley hatch, are um, being imposed on. Uh, I think that we certainly could cut down our volume of waste substantially Point of if order. we readjusted. Point of order. Yes, sir. We are not here tonight to discuss the maybes or not maybes of picking up trash. Well, we're, we're discussing we're the cost it. of the we're waste. We're doing it. So well, you can talk about the cost as we t talk about it, but don't and the get other, into the, the do's or the don'ts on the trash. And the because other that's problem, a total waste of time. The other problem, Please must move on. The other problem, gentlemen, is that the transfer station, which was built 20 years ago when the landfill was closed, was never built to handle the volume of waste that it handles today. And before you know it, you're going to be looking at a Warren article to build a new transfer station. That station is overworked as far as I can see. So I just want to put that out there. I think it is a very poor thing for a community to be collecting commercial waste. And if we want to continue in the same pattern and be stuck and have trouble with all of our Point of order, ma'am. Yes. Point of order. Yes. I believe that there was a Warren article. There was. And the people in town voted on it. There are Warren been, articles it's here. Been, it's been decided. And, and there are recent. Warren articles all over so, this place. I know, I know. It could be a new one. I know. It's, it's been talked about before. I there was know a Warren that. article, and it was. But when I hear the struggles of this department, when I hear the staffing problems in this department, when I hear the vehicle problems in this department, when I hear all of the difficulties uh, with collecting this huge volume of waste, I think it's a very sad situation. I would like to take a moment to comment on your comments yes, earlier sir. about not picking up commercial rubbish. Correct. Two years ago, you did sponsor a Warren article, and it was voted on, and my memory serves me 83% of the community voted against that idea for many reasons, not the least of which was the contributions the commercial people make to the tax base, the inability to pick up rubbish at the beach because there was no place for <coughs> commercial buildings to store it, there was no land for the dumpsters and things of that nature. So I just wanted to put that on the record. I understand that, Mr. Ladd, and I respect the business community, but I will say that the businesses like the Galley Hatch and LeMays and Hannaford, who have been paying as a business expense to dispose of their own waste over all these years, are being unfairly treated as well as the taxpayers because they're paying other businesses' expenses. Madam Chair. And I don't think it's fair. Madam Chair, no. I, believe, I believe Mr. Ladd's point was yep. that the voters spoke and he wants to respect the voters. Isn't that right, Bob? That's right. right. It was, right. I, I wish, thought it was I, the primary job of everyone here. I thought so, too. But when you look, for example, four years ago, uh, we had a warrant article that said, shall, shall the town maintain the sidewalks on Ocean Boulevard? We voted 63% no. Yet, there are members sitting in this room that are sitting in other bodies voting to do just that. Mm -hmm. So when we talk about respecting the voters, let's do it right down the line. Vote for the sidewalks if you return to me. Um, I'm not referring to anyone in particular, but if you want to look at the record, there are members in this room, and I wasn't referring to you, Regina.